Hello everyone and welcome to Jumper Man Tech where we specialize in HVAC but do everything DIY and today we're going to be performing a condenser coil cleaning. Thank you to everyone tuning in to Jumper Man Tech. Today we're going to be performing a condenser coil cleaning on both these heat pumps. We're going to begin by turning off the power to both condensing units. We're going to be washing both. Let's begin by taking off some of these screws and get as much access as we can. These Cooper and Hunter units are actually pretty cool. You can get to all these boards very easily. Much easier than Fujitsu, I must say. Not bad, not bad. Put the vacuum on backwards, now it's blowing air out. Clean the electrical components as well while we're here. I don't know if you can see, but there's dust flying out of here. Got the pressure washer set up, go to bucket, and now we're gonna mix the new bright condenser coil cleaner with water. If the other coil has a light soil, one part new bright, eight parts water medium soil one part new bright six parts water heavy soil one part new bright four parts water so let's go ahead and mix this up and apply it on our coil we're going to pressurize this so while we prep that one we're going to start applying the coil cleaner here on the front and back did do was remove the outdoor air sensor here so we don't get any chemical on that and once again it's going to continue to apply you want to get the cleaner deep in there so it can foam up and push all the dirt out i usually start from the top because it does make its way down so just keep doing this So I like to coat it and then I hit it again and then it's going to start to foam. Begin to see it starting to foam. Beautiful. Alright, now we're starting to really foam. That's what I want to see. Alright, we're starting to foam up on the inside too. Great. Let that sit and push everything out. And then we just rinse it off really well. All right, so here's the pump. I'm gonna set it to outdoor. Outdoor has a little bit more pressure. Let's watch the gauge. All right, 140 PSI. And from here, I like to go from the inside and push all that stuff out. Just rinse this down really well. See the water going through the coil. So I will go from the inside out. Could adjust the nozzle as well. When I rinse it, I go down at an angle because you don't want to push the dirt back inside. 
So that's pretty much it. Just want to give it a good rinse after you applied the cleaner. A lot of dirt coming out of this one. Gonna finish this off with a quick little vacuum. Nice and clean. Roof is clean. Coil is clean. You could actually see through it. I don't know if you can see that light. Now that is a beautiful thing. From here, got this one foaming up. Bunch of dirt coming out of here. And we're just going to repeat the process. If anyone found this video interesting or helpful, please drop a like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll catch you all next time.